I believe you'd like to run a surplus. You have two choices to do that. The first choice is to live within your means and cut your budget. And I'm assuming you don't want to do that. So let's talk about the other choice. And that is to increase your revenue. How can you increase your revenue so that you have a surplus at year end? Technique one, get very, very good at the revenue stream that most fits you that has the longest runways. Most nonprofits choose either earned revenue or donations. If you choose donations, the process is pretty basic, but not necessarily easy. You need a funnel to gather people. You need a pipeline to connect those people to your organization. And then at some point, you need a filter to look for the hand raisers to say people, I want to donate. Once people are raising their hands and actively donating with you, then you need to sit down with them and figure out how to partner together to create both of your dreams and help them come true. That's number one, get a specialty, figure out what it is and get very good at it. Number two, pick up all the other income, all the easy income that comes your way that fits a criteria you set. That is, we will work and invest $1,000 in order to make $7,000. And if the ratio is not one to seven, we're not going to do it. So every nonprofit will have a different ratio. But before you invest in earning that revenue, make sure your ratio is such that you know you will win with it. And then the third piece is do less. Many organizations are event heavy. They're doing things that don't provide them that ratio, don't provide them those returns, and they're not spending time where their main revenue stream is. To create a surplus based on revenue at your nonprofit, get very good at the revenue stream that has the biggest runway for you.